All right, by now we all know that Shannon Sharp left undisputed or got fired, you know, depending on whatever way you want to look at it. I don't know exactly what happened, but I know it's pretty much over with. And I want to say congratulations to him, you know, because, hey, shit, at the end of the day, he got a buyout. He already got millions of dollars in the bank, so it ain't like he's going to be struggling or nothing. On the other hand, Skip Bayless, he's going to be finished in a minute. He's going to be through because the only reason people watch that show is because of Shannon Sharp. Nobody want to sit there and listen to Skip Bayless, old bag face ass, hate on LeBron every single day. Nobody wants to hear that over and over and over again. And quiet is kept, I think that's part of the reason that Shannon Sharp is labeled as a LeBron fanboy now. Because he got to sit across from the, across from this fool every day and listen to horse shit about somebody that, you know, he's cool with. Now, I don't want to get too far off the subject, but there's another player in this uh, scenario. And we all know Kwame Brown, you know, he as soon as Shannon Sharp gets fired or quits, he comes out, oh, yeah, you unemployed. Hey, look at you. You're talking that shit about me. Then let, let your punk ass go. You unemployed. Is there anybody watching this video that would rather be in Kwame Brown's situation over Shannon Sharp's? As far as financials, I'm saying, because he's trying to make light of Shannon Sharp being unemployed. Like, you know, like Shannon Sharp was living check to check or something. That's something that a little kid would do because nobody on this planet would rather do what Kwame, Kwame Brown is doing right now over being unemployed with tens of millions of dollars in the bank. You understand? Like, a lot of this shit is just based off emotion. And Kwame Brown has that problem. He speaks from the heart. And he got a lot of hate in his heart, man. That dude got a lot of hate in his heart because he wasn't shit at basketball and people keep bringing that shit to the light. And I know that hurts. But who are you to make light of somebody being unemployed? And like I said, it, it don't make sense because it's not like Shannon Sharp is going to miss a meal or something. He can go get another job. His, his internet show is going to be straight. Skip Bayless is the one that's going to suffer. And rightfully so. His wife is mad at his ass. His family is mad at him. He just looks like a complete dick, and that's just what he is. And he's been that for so long. This man had no athletic ability whatsoever. But he consistently downgrades great athletes over and over and over again, and he gets paid very well to do that. So I wonder what brother they're going to replace Shannon Sharp with, because it takes a lot to deal with a Skip Bayless. It takes a hell of a lot to deal with a Skip Bayless. And we're going to hear more from Shannon Sharp, I'm sure. And unfortunately, we're going to also hear more from Kwame Brown because he, he wants to concentrate on Shannon Sharp being unemployed. You know, some old dumb shit. Look like this salty cracker right here. This premium saltine cracker. is finally going to get that, that, that blow that sends his ass into retirement. I can't wait for it. Skip Bayless fired. That's what I'm looking for. Smash them likes. Hit that subscribe. You're cooking with Frank.